Hi, welcome to our lesson for today. Our focus will be on systems technology and we are going to start looking at some introduction to concepts of computing. And at this stage, you're going to look at getting to know your desktop, which is getting to know the different types of computers that are there and what can you use it for. Right. Now, different types of computers, we're going to look at two different types of computers. Now let's look at the first one. It's a multi-purpose device. Now please note multi-purpose. What is it? Multi-purpose is a computer designed to perform many different tasks. Okay, so that explains why we say it's a multi-purpose device. And most of those multi-purpose devices use motherboards. Dedicated devices, which is a second type of a computer. Dedicated, note the word dedicated, and let's find out about it. It's a computer which is confined to perform only one function so that it can optimize efficiency or convenience. Meaning, you know, when a computer does a lot of things, one of the other function might suffer. So dedicated, it's meant to perform only one function so that it can be more efficient and convenient for use. And most of those would have a microprocessor chip. For example, you think of your microwave. And for multipurpose, you think of a, uh, your PC at home. So let's look at it, uh, those um, different types with more examples. You have a multipurpose device. Some of the examples would be your desktop, your laptop, your smartphone, your media player here, your netbook, and some of the servers, and you can also have a tablet. So these are some of the devices that can perform more than one function. All right, then that is why we call them multi-purpose devices. Then we look at dedicated devices, which we sometimes call embedded computers. Remember what we said, they perform only one specific function to optimize efficiency. So example would be your ATM. ATM would deal with your money, transactions, and that's it. Some of your electronic appliances, we have more. For example, here would have a microwave where you can know you deal with your food, warming, cooking, and that's it. Okay, so that is all that we're gonna focus on on this lesson, because remember, we're still introdu uh, introducing to these topics, and we're gonna focus on another topic and we're going to find out more about these um, computers.